What the debates giveth, they can also taketh away. Just ask former Vice President Walter Mondale about his encounters with Ronald Reagan in 1984. When I left the dressing room where I was, walked 50 feet to the platform, that's the longest walk I ever took in my life. And he came out swinging. We've got to deal with this problem. Reagan we, stumbled badly. The system is still where it was with regard to uh, the, uh, with regard to... He seemed confused and tired. He was grabbing onto that lectern, and I was very worried about him. Even then, there were whispers about Alzheimer's, but Mondale refused to hit Reagan on his memory. I never did it. I wouldn't do it. Uh, that's not my kind of politics. Do, I'm going to pick up but then, in the next the debate, Reagan rebounded the and was funny. The oldest man ever to run for president hit the age issue out of the park. I will not make age an issue of this campaign. I am not going to exploit, for political purposes, my opponent's youth and inexperience. <laughs> And what are you thinking? I was laughing while I was crying. <laughs> <laughs> you know, I, I knew he, he had hit home on that. And who told Ronald Reagan to have a one-liner ready? Roger Ailes, the same man who's now informally helping his friend, Donald Trump. 